All right, so we've started to transition into some high crotch or head outside single offense here. It's probably been my primary offense throughout most of my career. Um, and just getting into this head outside or this outside step high crotch and just realizing the benefits of how much quicker it is than a penetration step high crotch. Um, but just realizing also that it needs to be off of pressure and you need to be a little bit closer to the guy. If I'm way out in the open, I'm not going to be hitting an outside step high crotch from out here. So getting in here, and as I showed before, just the setup um, to doing this is I'm just pressuring in. Very simple, short step, and then big step with my outside foot, and really clearing this arm to here, to my high crotch. My inside hand comes to the crotch, outside hand follows after I've cleared it. Now, getting into our finishes here, we're going to start out pretty basic, and we're going to kind of work up into uh, a little bit more advanced stuff, depending on how this guy reacts. But starting out, ideally I would like to double leg this guy from here. So, same as our double leg finish, everything is the, just the same right now, except that my hands are locked on one hand, our leg instead of two. So basically, to finish here, we're gonna just switch that hand over. So I don't wanna do that until I actually get pressure going over that direction. So again, that's why it's important that I have three feet in a row. I have my head up, hips in, and back straight in here, because if I'm in bad position, I'm not gonna be able to ever reach this leg. So I'm gonna start to drive into them as we come up to our feet here, then we can switch off at the knee just like we did on our double. But again, I don't wanna be just trying to reach I don't want to just be trying to reach for that leg from here and trying to finish. That's not going to work. I also don't want to be coming up here. And I also don't want to try to finish from my knees. I see a lot of guys get lazy and try to do this. Just kind of walk the block. Like, that's not going to work. He's not actually going to fall over there. I need to come up off my feet and I actually need to run through him. So once I get in on the side crotch, again, it's a very simple finish, very much like the double. It's just making sure that you're patient enough to get his weight shifting over to that other foot before I actually drive through. So, good head position, got my inside tie, pressure, 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 short inside step, big outside step, clear that arm, got my high crotch here now again, making sure that weight starts to shift, coming up, short steps, driving through, and getting our finish here. So one more time from the other angle, again, inside tie, good head position, pressuring, inside step, outside step, head up, hips in, back straight. Three feet in a row, ready to drive across, not finishing up at his hip, finishing at his knee, and getting our takedown. Again, this is a more basic finish. This is ideally what we want, but against better guys, it's sometimes hard to get this, so we're going to get into some other things if we can't get our double leg next.